What up, YouTube? I'm, uh, I'm back at it with some, uh, some fire uh, holes, some fire pickups. Um, I don't know why you guys haven't subscribed yet, and if you have, you're, you're the, you're the, you're the guy, you're the woman, because, as you know, um, I post up some things that, that YouTube have never seen before, and this video is, is the same thing, um, I'm, I'm bringing you some stuff that YouTube haven't seen, and, you know, um, and I'm always gonna do that, I'm, I'm gonna check what's out there that people haven't reviewed, and I'm gonna review that, uh, because I have a lot of stuff that a lot of people don't have, and, um, so yeah, so let's just start this. Alright, cool. Uh, first pickup, uh, I guess, um, I'm gonna tell you how to got it. The first one is, um, the Bait Roadsters. Um, how I got these was, I actually got these on a trade with, um, this, this shoe, this hat, and also, um, a Susi shirt. Uh, tie dye shirt. It's it's kind of dope. It's an eight ball shirt, um, but it's not that important. But you know, it's it's worth mentioning. So I traded my my Chris Van Asher side laces um, to the same guy that sold me it, which is kind of like okay, all right, cool. Uh, he said he missed it, so he wanted it back. So um, he traded me this Bape hat, the Bape Roadsters, and then the Stussy shirt. Um, in my in my eyes, that was a that was a fair trade. Just because I posted up those shoes on eBay for a while and it hasn't moved at all. Um, so I'm, I'm glad and I barely wore them. And I've been wearing these a lot. It's just a comfortable shoe. Uh, I'm not really wearing Nikes. Not because of the hype or anything like that. But I feel no point of it. So this this gives that that look of the Air Max. That feel of the Air Max. But with the Bape um, logo. Um, so yeah, so quick review. Uh, on the inside it has a Bape um stuff logo bait logo right here kind of messed up because i wear them this is a size eight i'm um, see if i can get you the tag no i can't oh there it is this is from foot soldiers um and another thing is i love that they don't have any stars or anything like this i i this is one of my pet peeves having shoes that i have to take care of for the bottom of it you know if i want to sell it this shoe i love just because Heck, no stars whatsoever. Even if I like wear the crap out of these, the bottom will be fine, which I really love. Um, ventilated um, uh, toe box. You know, it's an all white shoe, leather. Uh, dope, simple. Now, I might be, I might do a, a review of just detailed it out and stuff like that. So the next one we got is um, a Bape hat, Bape red camel hat. Um, as as far as I know, this is the only Bape uh, ape head that's shown. This is the bottom. Um, what else? Let's see what else. Let's see what. Okay, the tag. Let me show you the tag. Um, there it is. Um, so yeah, so I really like this hat, but it just feels weird. You know, it looks really high. I usually like to wear my hats where I can feel the top. But if I do that, look look how look how stupid I look. You know. Um, so yeah, so I have this, uh, trucker hat, and it also came with this tag, the Bape tag, let's see if I can get it, um, on the inside we have the Bape logo peeping, it says, we early, hmm, and on the bo bottom, back, I mean, it's brown, simple tag, alright, let's, let's move on, because I have a whole bunch of other things. Um, next one is the Fear of God pants, thermals. Uh, when I got them, it wasn't like this. I, I left them on the floor looking for them, and then the tag was falling off. So I got to fix that. Um, but here's the tag, second collection, Fear of God second collection, 2013 and 2014. Um, but yeah, simple pants, thermals. Um, the drawstrings itself, this is, I think this is what makes the Fear of God pants from any other pants, is the drawstrings, look how long those things are, it's ba basically touching my, my knees, which is a cool concept. Um, the drawstrings itself is like, sort of like a suede. Um, but besides that, besides this tag, 
um, there's no other um, noticeable things for fear of God. So if that tithe falls off, no one believe me it's fear of God. Um, so yeah, that's that's the pants. And my next pickup is these suede tan Chelsea boots. Chelsea's has been um, on the on the run for a while now. A lot of people been scooping them up and stuff. So we have a wooden uh, sole. Not really wooden, but yeah. So this is a shoe the bear, size 42. Um, very soft. When I first got them, they're 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 really clean. But one thing about these shoes, they get dirty super quick. I wore them once. Look how dirty they are already. Um, but yeah, such a dope shoe. I just wish that this was a different color. Maybe like the same color as this. But, you know, I paid a good price. So I'm not going to complain. Um, we have that, that loop right there. The tag. No box. I didn't get no box. Um, so yeah, so here's the other pickup. I got these for 160 I believe. Something like that. And the best for last, in my opinion, the new wave. Which is these motocross pants. I'm going to start wearing the crap out of these. Um, I just love them. Uh, who actually inspired me to wear these was actually uh, Chris Julian. Um, I had a photo shoot with him. And, um, you know, my brother works for him. So, Ken was, my brother was like, oh, yo, Chris Julian's wearing these motocross pants. It looks super dope. And, and in my head, I was like, yo, motocross pants, who wears those? So I thought it was super cool that you know someone else is wearing something different. So I, you know me, I gotta I gotta wear the same thing. So it's a new wave. Um, there is like a tag there. Um, so yeah, these are gonna be the essential now. Step on it before it's too late. Uh, same thing with like you know uh, leggings with shorts. People thought that was super weird, and then it had its phase when everyone started doing it. Same thing with these. I feel like this is going to be the new wave where everyone wants motocross pants or vintage. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. Vintage tees. When they first, when, um, you know, when they weren't as popular, vintage tees, you know, 30 bucks, 40 bucks for 80s, 90 shirts. Now they're going for 150, 200 bucks for the same shirts. Um, so this one I picked up for uh, 20 bucks, I think. This is from 1994, original push head. You know, puss head. So, yeah, this is another one. Let me show you the back. I don't know if you can get it. Am I getting it? Yeah. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, I feel like this is going to be new stuff. So, yeah, this is super dope. Honestly, like any outfit, look, this looks really fire. Uh, just the, the 3D details to it. So, let me just show that real quick. On uh, each side, it says Axel. Um, we have this, I guess, like, I would just silicone type feel. And then we also got this, uh, uh, plastic by the knee on uh, right here on the belt. You know, it's, it has this, um, belt system. So you really don't have to worry about, you know, zip up, then you zip that secondary one for extra security. Uh, one thing about this is it doesn't have pockets, which sucks, but hell, like, I don't care. Uh, on the back, we have this air ventilated uh, system on the back, um, and it, it says sport axle all around. It's like a spandex material. Super cool. Uh, so, yeah, that's, that's, that's some stuff that I picked up. There's, a, there's some other things coming up. Yeezys. That, uh that I haven't got yet so wait on it uh, besides that I don't think I got anything else maybe some other things um, I'll show you that in, a, in another, another haul but um, so yeah so all in I think in a couple weeks so I'm gonna try to do this like every month you know a month haul to see what I got uh, so yeah this is what I've gotten I, I was actually gonna get these for prom but then my girlfriend didn't really like it, like how it looked with um, with the outfit. I was actually inspired by ASAP Rocky to wear like tan boots 
uh, he wore, I think, at the Met Gala, like last year. And I think it looks super cool. He was wearing an overcoat with like a tuxedo with, um, I think they're St. Laurent uh, jodhpurs actually. Um, or maybe just zip ups. But yeah, so that's why I got them. Love them. Uh, got some other things. So please subscribe. I'm, you know, I'm going I'm to do this almost every week. Um, so yeah, I got some dope things coming to YouTube. Thank you. Subscribe. Actually, you know, I'm, I'm going to stop saying subscribe because I hate when videos say, please subscribe. So I'm going to stop it. Last video, I'm ever going to say that. So um, you know what it is. This is my video that's taking too long. I don't know how to end this, so I'm just going to end it now.